There was always a lot of change uh, going on, and uh, but the team was really big. We were always very busy, so like delivering all of the drawings for Liverpool Street Station after all the changes, and it, it was very, very a proud moment to finally submit all of that. <laughs> I've taken a redesign of Fulwich, North Fulwich Portal, and where it used to be uh, an open compound that's prone to risk of flooding and I made it uh, uh, a secure, resilient uh, proposal, working with our architects, uh, working with our engineers, and facilitated um, a feasible solution to crush us. Uh, it's having to really move all these assets safely so that cross trail as it is at the moment could be built at Liverpool Street without disturbing the operation of the station. The work that I did on leading the communications for the asset handovers, uh, primarily the station handovers. So we came up with an idea to do live events where there'd be a YouTube link that we'd send out to colleagues and clients. I'd be there on the morning uh, and we'd make sure that really key players and people were there on the day, uh, as well as senior leaders from Crossrail and TFL uh, and key partners such as Costain and Balfour Beatty. Uh, got to say their bit, uh, and the response was brilliant. We had thousands of people join, uh, tune in. Uh, the feedback was amazing. It was a real, like, brought people together. Um, the commissioner, Andy Byford, absolutely loved it, which made it even better. Uh, so that's definitely, I'd say, my most memorable moment. The roof I was working on was quite nice. I checked it out, you know, both ends, the Liverpool and the Moorgate there. And, uh, I have to give credit to Peter Kracknell. He was Crossrail's design manager at that time. And uh, the contractor looked at our roof design, ticket for roof design, and said, we can't build this. And Peter was working with us, with the contractor's designer, until we massaged it so it could be built. More or less the same way, but the main feature was almost, almost the same, very little changes. And it looks very impressive. Credit to him and credit to our own architectural designer who first dreamed it up.